welcome back to my channel if you are new my name is Tiffany welcome so today's video I decided to create this very fall vampy makeup look right here I did pair it with like a burgundy mauve lip I really enjoyed doing this video for you guys like I said I love the fall time I did use a couple of my favorite products that I haven't used in about a year or so don't forget to give this video a, a thumbs up and if you're not subscribed to my channel go ahead and do so as well and don't forget to share my videos also and I will be having a video all up on how I did my kinky twist it took me less than two hours to do these so without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into this video so i did start out with my eyebrows already done like always so i'm gonna just go ahead and jump right into the eyes first because i think it's gonna be a little bit easier today i'm gonna go in with my la girl pro concealer in the color toffee i'm gonna use that to prime my eyelids today <laughs> And I'm going to be taking the BH Cosmetics G38. This is part of the Gunmetal Collection. I'm going to use that to blend everything out. So I am not going to be setting that with any translucent powder just because I want the colors to pop a little bit more. Today I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia Beverly Hills, but the modern renaissance, like the oldie but the goodie. I'm going to be taking my Morphe M573 brush. And the first color I am going to be dipping in is Real Gar, which is this orangey color right here. So I kind of know what I'm gonna I want to do, but at the same time I don't. I'm gonna be using that as my transition color. You guys already know I'm gonna lightly just pack it on and then blend out in circular motions. I am going for a matte look though. <music> taking that same brush and I'm gonna go in with red orca and I'm gonna put that just below my transition color I'm going to be taking this blending brush and I'm going to just blend those two colors together. Make sure I don't get any. So I'm going to be taking this color right here. And I'm going to be applying that with a BH Cosmetics pencil brush. Placing that also in my crease. I'm going to be going in with this color pop this is the super shock eyeshadow and paradox it looks like this it's like a burgundy eyeshadow so I'm gonna use my finger to apply this I haven't used this these in a cool minute hopefully it's not all dried out on me we're gonna find out now <laughs> taking that same morphe brush i'm not gonna add any more products just yet i'm gonna just blend everything out i want it i'm gonna be using my mYx matte liquid eyeliner i'm gonna be going in with my lash couture lashes in the style corset For primer today, I'm going to be going in with my Becca Ever Matte Primer. So, I'm going to go ahead and spray my face with my coconut face mist. For foundation, I'm going to be going in with my NYX. 
Can't Stop Won't Stop Foundation and I am in the color Milka, of course. <laughs> to be going in with an Odie but a goodie. This is my MAC Pro Long Concealer and I am in the color NC45. I haven't used this concealer in a very, very long time. I remember um, that's all I used to wear was MAC. Nothing else but MAC. is always like a really good 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 concealer I'm gonna go ahead and set underneath my eyes with a little bit of Sasha buttercup and I'm actually gonna be taking my real techniques highlighter brush but we're gonna use it to set underneath the eye <laughs> This is the Makeup by Shayla collaboration. Of course, I always use the... I'm going to go in with the darkest shade. So, I'm going to be going in with my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish in the color Dark. And I'm just going to go ahead and dust off the powder. Bring some color back into my face like I said that Laura Mercier setting powder personally I kind of feel like on darker skin complexion like myself it does leave a cast I'm gonna be going in with my matte global glow my Morphe highlighter brush this is the M501 brush the only brush that I ever use <laughs> I'm going to be taking, I believe this is the Ruby Kisses blush in the color Toasted Almond. I'm going to be going ahead and taking this color right here. And I'm going to be putting that as close to my bottom lash line as I can get it. So I'm going to use that same brush and go into um, red or green do the same thing. So I'm going to be taking Vermeer and I'm going to be placing that in my inner tear duct. I'm going to be going in with my Urban Decay All Nighter. line my lips with the Jordana in chocolate cherry <music> NYX liquid suede in the color vintage So let me go ahead and use my Maybelline Falsies to add to my bottom lash line. 
you guys this is the finished look right here i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next video bye